take a look, but know that what you see, the trees, the flowers and the animals, might not be there in the not so distant future. This exhibition by Borusan Contemporary is comprised of works by six international contemporary artists. They all look at similar topics, today's environment and what it may look like in the future. Merging their ideas with software programs, digitized landscapes and video works, it's as if these artists are telling cautionary tales in their artworks. For instance, this piece is showing some of the chemical elements from the periodic table. These particular ones are used for making cars. And with the help of an app, the piece turns into an augmented reality installation, transporting visitors to a scrapyard in Ghana. The aim here is to show that when we take abundantly from nature with a return policy of no responsibility at all, the result is a damaged environment. For thousands of years, humanity has been making use of everything in its power to understand its surroundings. Magic, religion, ancient myths, even looking to the stars for answers. And now it's technology. But the objective remains the same, understanding nature and our place in it. The organizers find it only natural that we should use the latest technology to narrate our life stories. The artist is trying to express uh, his or herself to, through a media. I mean, all the, at the old time it was a stone while craving on the, on the walls, then it was the painting and it was the photography. And right now we are living in a technological age, I mean, this uh, electronics. Uh, applications, videos are everywhere. So the artist of today is using these media to express his or herself. Latest studies warn that if we don't decrease our waste, in only 20 years we'll have more plastic in the oceans than fish. So art, which from the beginning of time has been a mirror of society, now bears the burden of abandoning aesthetics to reflect what's really going on in our world. Nur Sanat Tati, TRT World, Istanbul.